Hello guys, and welcome back to another episode of The Legend of Zelda number one. Now, one of the things you're probably catching slash noticing is that my rupee number went down. That's because this being an NES game, I guess I have to experience uh, whatever any other NES player in history experienced, which is... Not saving. I forgot to save, oddly enough, on this emulator. And... I lost all my rupees. I got enough back to buy the candle, because I knew that that's what I did. I didn't want to, like, buy anything different, because I felt like that'd be cheating. Oh, that was stupid of me. Okay, man. Freaking Dude. the most OP, spitty outer thing I've ever seen. Oh, I might die. I was doing really well before you guys came, I swear to god. It's all your fault. Yeah. Whatever. Um, I know where I'm going, I discovered a small, slight location. I discovered a little location here, uh, that I wanted to head towards. So you go up. Oh, frick. Should've saved that heart. So yeah, we're gonna go explore that. I asked my buddy, who has played this game, and he said that it's not like 100% farming items until they find the Triforce or something. So that's good. Oh, dude. I'm doing really bad, sorry. Just because I'm talking and playing at the same time. I'm not used to it. Well, I'm used to it with like Minecraft, but this is a reaction intensive game. And I got some bombs that uh, some of these guys dropped. I just haven't used. Great game. I'm just brushing it, that's all. There we go. Okay. I feel like I've gotten a pretty good grasp on the mechanics of this game. Don't use what I've played so far as an example of that. Oh, I keep like... Dude. Oh, I suck. Screw what I just told you, I absolutely suck. This guy's gone, right? Yeah, I, I bought it from the same shop owner and everything, so... Here, here's where it is. Damn it! Uh, I got my dog in my room, so to hear like crunching or, or right now he's like chewing on a bone, so you might hear some of that noise. Oh, boy! Okay, there we go. I'm good. I'm just gotta keep your distance with these things. Gotta remember that. I'm just charging the battle, man. Keep your distance. Gonna go over here this time. This way is the proper way to go. Also found out that rupees do despawn after a really quick period of time. Cool. So yeah, I'm gonna try to avoid that happening. They don't even like follow you really. They just kind of happen to. Like, if that guy had shot at me, he totally would have taken some of my health. The AIs in this game are really odd. I don't care. I'm not complaining. Damn it. Stupid. I'm not even gonna bother with these freaking fairy things. I've seen the fairies. They're pain in the arse. And nothing more. No, those are all Okay. Nope, I'm gonna... Oh. I don't want to bother risking it. Okay, so this is the place that I discovered here. Obviously, if I take this guy out, which I can do without taking it yet. Of course. Of course. The tree blocks my shot. There we go. Got it. Ooh. Holy crap. This is like...
fast, no big deal. Right? Yes, the one hits. Ooh, I got a key. Awesome. Let's go through here. I don't know what those little statue things are. I guess they're statues. I'm just glad it wasn't some kind of crazy ass puzzle and terrible clothes. I played Uncharted. I know it was crazy ass puzzles. Skeleton key, sir. Just spend money on keys, just farm them from here. Kind of crazy, crazy guy would blow money on keys. I'm assuming I can use the key to unlock this door with the keyhole, right? Yeah, right on. Are all these keys, like, universal keys? I don't understand. Because, like, if I if I just pick up any key from anywhere, will it unlock any door from anywhere? I'm assuming it will, because this is an NES game, but... Oh, hello, fairy. Very nice of you to show up. Why these undead monsters have fairies on them? Seems like a weird combination. Oh, 
Yeah. Stairs are blocked. Whatever. Continue. Let's continue on our expedition. Oh, it's gonna respawn me here. I'm liking the way this game feels. Very forgiving. Oh, don't lose the freaking sword. That was my biggest mistake last time. If we had had the sword, I bet we would have had this game beat. Totally. See that? I'm starting to get this down. I'm starting to get this down pretty pat. Left side this time. Left side first. Bats. Freaking bats. Okay, let's go to the other side. I don't want to walk through any doors. Take big steps quite yet. to do, where to go. I'm just gonna head straight for the boss. I'm just get whatever keys I get when I go along.
task forms. Um, deal especially with the power sword. You look scary. You look scary, you scary task form. You can bother me, cast form? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Ain't no cast form that can come in my house and tell me what to do. It's such a weird thing for like the game developers to come up with. I mean, you have so many options for a game. Like this is like like Zelda was the first sort of fantasy epic thing. Ah, oh, dude, you sons of bitches! You sons of bitches! You don't ruin my day. You don't ruin my day. That's right, freaking bomb. Just placed it on you. Don't even care. Don't even care. Said boomerang is exactly what I need to damage this bastard. Hopefully, one of these guys has a fairy on him. If there are any. Where's he gonna come from? Can I even damage this weird ghost hand? I'm not gonna try. Oh, no, there he is. Oh, ghost hand. Nope, oh, that's scary. I will not be so defenseless when facing my enemies. A potion would also be great, but I don't think I can buy those yet. Oh, this works too. So, will this like one hit skeletons? Oh, it just stuns them. What a little crap. How come it damages me but stuns them? Oh. I don't even know if I want to keep going now. This game, man. This game is so... I don't know, it's just intriguing. It's like mist, almost. It's like you're sort of dropped in the middle of a place. You don't know what's going on. You don't know why you're there and why you're there. You just gotta, like, uncover the truth. Yeah, now you drop a heart. Now you drop a heart, skeleton. Now you drop your good old-fashioned tin heart. Despawned right before my eyes, skeleton bitch. Valid title, of course. I just call them rupees. It's, I think it's better slightly. Oh crap! Oh crap! You done messed up. You done messed up, bats. Ah, this is so irritating, man. information that was on purpose.
Or just like skim you and then you freak out and I'm like, oh, I don't know. I know I'm probably complaining and it's stupid, but it's like, I don't know, it, it, it just throws me off because it's like, alright, he's gonna head right for me, he's gonna shoot at me, and then he doesn't. Dragon, okay, you know, never saw that coming. I beat the dragon. Feel so accomplished. I miss boss battles like that. You don't really have a game with really like a simple boss battle where it's just like, here's the game, here's the boss, here's another boss. Oh, no, that was fun. Loved it. Okay. Anyways, uh, thank you so much for watching. Should we like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and I'll be seeing you in the next episode where I'll walk through this door.